The Nobel Prize in Medicine comes to two Philadelphia scientists at the University of Pennsylvania. And the prestigious award was given for their technology that created the COVID-19 vaccines. Health reporter Stephanie Salt is going to tell you more about today's announcement. This was big, you guys. Yeah. Very big. Very big achievement. You know, these two hometown heroes are credited with helping to end the pandemic with a vaccine that came from their work. And when they got the call this morning at 340, they were shocked. Mm -hmm. This has to be a prank. Dr. Drew Weissman and Catalin Carrico describing the early morning call, learning they'd won the Nobel Prize in medicine. We worked hard, but we enjoyed. The team from the University of Pennsylvania discovered how to modify mRNA that eventually led to the development of the COVID-19 vaccines. I think that's fantastic. I spoke to Dr. Weissman in November of 2020 when he first learned the vaccine was effective. What do you think about that? I mean, it, it, it's unbelievable. Making something that helps people is is what my life life's dream has been. Dr. Weissman and Carrico say developing the vaccine was a long process with many setbacks. It had failed clinical trials, and pretty much everybody gave up on it. But they were convinced they'd found a way to activate the immune system. If you like to solve problems, that uh, you know, science is for you. And theirs is the science that changed history, leading to the end of the pandemic. Millions of lives have been saved and scores of others have been protected from severe disease. A huge accomplishment that started with a chance meeting. In 1997, we met at the copy machine. That copy machine chat led to the COVID vaccine, and now the technology is being tested for the treatment of many other illnesses, including cancer. More than 250 clinical trials ongoing on mRNA right now. They didn't say what they'll do with the million dollar Nobel Prize money and are now focused on the next medical breakthrough. Science is what moves the world forward. Mm, about that. Now the scientists and Penn are being paid for the COVID vaccine through licensing fees. No information how, how much that is. But this technology is considered invaluable by many. How about that this all started with a conversation at the copy machine? I was just going to say, we'll all have to toast them with a cup of coffee tomorrow <laughs> yeah, morning. Exactly. Right. How about 340 this morning you get that call? Like, you go back what? to sleep after that? No, they stayed up okay. <laughs> waiting for the official announcement. That's fantastic. incredible. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.